good morning welcome back to my channel so bunky and i are headed to the farm right now we're gonna go have breakfast with my parents i think my dad's gonna make me some of his best scrambled eggs i'm so excited and then we're actually gonna go walk the property to kind of figure out where we want to build our house so we are very very excited and i figured i'll just bring you guys along with us for the day So we stopped and got some Starbucks on the way to the farm and then my mom had actually made some sausage balls and of course my dad made me some scrambled eggs and y'all my mom had already decorated for Christmas and oh my goodness it is so so beautiful so of course I had to share it with you guys. I think this is actually the first year that they have been completely done with renovations so of course my mom wanted to go all out and it is just stunning. You guys are going to love it and since I did not get to go all out decorating this year since we're moving of course I wanted to show you guys like a little farmhouse Christmas home tour so I hope you guys enjoy all of my mom's beautiful Christmas decor Okay, so whenever Bunky and I first got our camper, we actually got someone to clear out a space over here um, on this part of my parents' property. And we thought we were gonna park the camper here. And it ended up just being like way too tight to get it in the way we did it. So it's parked over in the field. But because this space is already cleared out, we've always thought this would be a great space for a house. So that's what we're gonna go walk and see what we think about it. Okay, good morning. I have got my coffee. It is the next day. Bunky and I actually left the farm. We went to the grocery store, got a few things, and then we ended up grilling out on the big green egg last night. We just made a steak and like a salad. It was so, so good. And this morning, I got my Cricut machine because I have been wanting to like do some personalized gifts. And I have like a really cute idea, which I'm going to share with you guys in just a second. But I was also looking on Zillow, of course, at houses. And there was a house at the beach on the street that Bunky and I dream dream of living on because it's so close to the condo and like perfect location to everything and it was the best price and Bunky and I both were like oh my goodness I've actually been looking at this house and then it um got sold and then all of a sudden this morning it came back on the market and it was like at no fault to the seller all this stuff so anyway B and I were like, oh my gosh, we have to go see this house before it gets taken. Um, I don't think I told you guys this, but I think I said this on Instagram. Another big idea that we have is to actually buy our own condo or like little tiny beach house at the beach, of course, um, and live in it while we build for a year and then keep it and actually be able to rent it out to you guys and just, you know, whoever wants to go and stay there. So when we saw this house, we were like, oh my gosh, we have to go see it. So after I show you guys 
my fun little um, Christmas gift idea with my Cricut, we are actually getting in the car and driving to the beach today. So we have a long day. I'm going to need more of this coffee. Um, but anyway, I'm going to bring you guys along with us. And we are so excited to go have some hamburger joes tonight. But first things first, let me show you my gift idea with my Cricut. So a big thank you to Cricut for sponsoring today's video. I am so excited to make some personalized gifts. I just think that they are extra special. And I actually went to Walmart and I bought one of these clear glass mugs. I love a glass mug. I think they're like so aesthetically beautiful and they're like a dollar. So super inexpensive. And I'm actually going to take my vinyl. I was trying to decide if I wanted to do red, green, or white. I think I'm going to actually use my white vinyl that way um the person that i'm gifting this to can use it even after christmas but if you wanted to do like a festive holiday mug it would be super cute to use a green or a red vinyl but i'm gonna use white so i need my white vinyl my transfer tape my mat of course my weeding tool scissors and then i think this is called like a scraper and besides my coffee mug that is all that i need and then of course i'll be using my Cricut Explore Air 2. So once I get my Cricut machine turned on and everything lined up, I am just going to open my Cricut Design Space and I'm going to click New Project and then I'm going to go over to Images and I'm just typing in Cup of Cozy and then kind of going through all of the hundreds and hundreds of images that are already in the Cricut Design Space and finding one that I really like. So I really wanted this to say like cup of cozy or something about being cozy. I absolutely love this one that says cozy season. And then I also love the simplicity of this one that says warm and cozy. And then there's a few others that are super cute as well. So once I have sized my wording to make sure it's going to fit on my coffee mug, I'm just going to go ahead and cut a piece of white vinyl that is going to fit my wording. And then I'm going to place it on my mat exactly where I have it lined up in my Cricut Design Studio. So then I'm going to click make it. I'm going to make sure that my machine is turned to vinyl since that is the material that I'm going to be using. And then I just let the Cricut do its job. So once it's finished, I will just come right over here. I will hit this button so that it will release my project. And then I need to go ahead and get my weeding tool out and take off any excess vinyl. Once I get off all of the excess vinyl, I'm just gonna take a piece of my transfer tape and I'm gonna cut it to be like the exact same size as my other piece of vinyl. And then I'm just going to take that transfer tape, lay it on top of my wording and then take my scraper tool and just make sure that I get that wording transferred to my transfer tape. And then I'm just gonna place that transfer tape onto my coffee mug take my scraper over it one more time and then be able to pull that off and all that's going to be left on my coffee mug is my warm and cozy wording. This turned out even cuter than what I envisioned. It is so adorable. It was so easy. I think it's just so sweet and special to be able to give a personalized gift. Okay, so now that I have my adorable little coffee mug, y'all, this turned out so precious. I want to make one for myself too. I'm just going to get a little Starbucks gift card, a piece of ribbon, and then a piece of tissue paper. And I'm just going to put my gift card in here, wrap up my tissue paper, and stick it inside my coffee mug and then I'll put this in a cute little bag and what a great gift. So I will have Cricut's website linked down below in my description box. Be sure you guys head down there and check them out. Okay, I cannot wait to make many more of these. So fun and so cute. I'm gonna go ahead and put all my stuff away. Bunky is over here making a sandwich to take with us on the road. We're gonna get some lunch and then hop in the car. Have you already packed? I have. I gotta go pack really fast while you make your sandwich. Get your backpack, boo. We're heading south. Oh, we're so excited. <laughs> <laughs> you ready? You ready to go, girlfriend? <sighs> okay, one o'clock. We did it. 
We did. Let's go. So we need some gas. <clears throat> and you need a bite to eat. I need a bite to eat. We're taking a little pit stop to get some Zaxby's. I love me a good kicking chicken sandwich from Zaxby's with fries, extra ranch, extra Zach sauce, and a Coca-Cola. Mm. That's like the goodness right there. Oh yeah, may I have a number five with Coke and uh, Zach sauce in a ranch, please? Yeah, what else can I get for you? That'll be it. Eight, Thank you. I feel like I just said the word Coke very strange. What'd you say? Like, Coke? <laughs> that was weird. I don't know what happened. Okay, good morning. We are at the beach. We ended up going to Hamburger Joe's last night. It was amazing as always. We are so excited to get to go there. And this morning we are going to look at this house. So um, I don't think I told you guys that Bonnie's parents actually got a golf cart. So we're so excited. It's our first time being able to ride it. And we're actually just going to ride it over to this house, meet the realtor there and go check it out. I hope it's like everything we dream of. I know it's definitely gonna need like paint. We'll probably redo the kitchen if we end up getting this house and just like a few other things, but the location is perfection. Are you super excited? Super excited, Bunky. I cannot wait to see if this is like gonna be the Bunky Beach House. Could be, <laughs> we'll find out. Okay, mm -hmm. we have sad news. Very sad news. That was not our house. <laughs> no. Um, what was what was it about it, Bunky, that we didn't? It had some water damage in places, and it just felt like oh. a lot of work, like a, like almost like a money pit. It was um it was definitely going to require a whole lot more updating than the we pictures uh, gave. The pictures were deceiving. Yes, very much so. And it made it look a lot bigger and laid out better mm. than what it was. Mm-hmm. I didn't mind, mind the layout so much. I mean, there was a couple of strange things. Yeah. Like you went through that one bedroom to get up to the, the balcony. Yeah. And then, you know, that one room that was off the master. Right. That was weird. Um, what I didn't like the most was the parking situation. Yeah. And also the, just like the, the general, the stuff or you know the house is around it great location not so great house <clears throat> well it was a great location the actual location of the house was still a little bit a little bit not my preference yeah so we are at the ocean now we're gonna go 
take a walk on the beach for just a couple of minutes and then we're actually gonna drive back home tonight once Bunky gets off work we're just having like a little midday beach date <laughs> Okay, so that's going to do it for this video. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us. I love you so very much. We will be back in the kitchen once we get home this week and be whipping up some delicious recipes. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. Give this one a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, y'all.